OJ? Yeah, I like I didn't know he was sick. Me either. I, yeah. No. The last I'm not even that sure he what released... there's to say on it. I mean, he, yeah, he died yeah, of cancer. Yeah. The, the, the yeah. only thing that, that I'll ever remember about OJ, I mean, apart from the obvious, is just that being in, I think I was in grade five, and for mm. some reason we were listening to the verdict on the radio. Like, that's not i feel like <laughs> my school i feel like that's not a thing yeah yeah, yeah. And, and apparently that's a very common uh uh thing that's ha that happened I, I feel like that's weird like <laughs> playing the verdict it was, for, it was a for major, children. like it was a major moment in history like we we were watching it the entire school we, i was in high school the entire school was watching waiting for the verdict and when he got found not guilty we, you know, I was in the blackest neighborhood of South Florida, man. We all came running out, cheering at the top of our lungs, celebrating. We thought we won the Super Bowl, man. Yeah, of course, doing the saying, if it doesn't fit, you must quit. That's a quit. That was <laughs> and, you know, and, 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 and um, there was um, um, attorney Darden, I think his name, um, uh -huh. he was a, one of the prosecutors, and he wrote, he wrote about it again after. Um, George, not George, George Zimmerman. After George Zimmerman got away with murdering Trayvon Martin, um, attorney Darden wrote about how a lot of people celebrated when OJ got off and that was misplaced. But it was like, when you look at the injustices that came afterwards, um, it was just really, really interesting how he, he put it like that. But it was a milestone though. So, if you guys were watching it in fifth grade, that means we're just a little bit older than you. We were watching it in, in high school and people yeah. were watching it in colleges. It was it was everywhere when they came down with that verdict. Yeah, I was in fourth grade. And yeah, I remember the teachers busting out the TV on the rolling car and everyone was watching it. And it was weird because like the kids were like, I was talking with my friends and the teachers were like, shh, shh. like everybody was just like glued <laughs> to the TV. And I like, I didn't really understand why I was in fourth grade. Like I did not have the attention span. And like, you know, there were, I remember a conversation with, you know, kids at the table. One girl was like, I think that he's not guilty. And then another kid was like, no, he's definitely guilty. And I, I, like, I'm in fourth grade. I'm like, I don't know what those words mean. Like, what is guilty, <laughs> not guilty? I don't know. Like, I'm completely tuned out. I just remember the reactions and being deeply bored, uh, bored uh, by it because it's like, deeply you know. Deeply bored. <laughs> yeah, I was <laughs> deeply bored. And I'm just like, why are we watching this? Can I like read my Goosebumps book or some shit? Like, I don't right. understand. I'm, I'm in fourth grade. I'm eight. It's also how we got the Kardashians, if I'm not mistaken. I, right? somebody, I just That's saw somebody in the chat say that. Can, can, you, ex can you explain that? How 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 did how how did oh, that happen? They're, they're, they're I, I don't know how lawyer. it happened, but yeah. I just know. Dad, who was it? Not, their dad was his lawyer. His name. Yeah, yeah, it was one of the lawyers okay. for the case. Excuse me, y'all. I just want to be remember. clear. Kim Kardashian's dad is not Johnny Cochran. No. <laughs> there was another lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> and I remember they showed videos of Kim and everybody being there at the trial doing the case and everything. I'm like, oh my gosh, they yeah. look like regular people. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, well, that was. Uh, I don't. I don't think we uh, put on, put it on the radio. If I recall, I can't recall really. I don't remember how old I was then. Yeah, I got. I guess I'm Mike's age, right? How old are you, got, Mike? Thirty-seven. All right. Yeah. So I was probably in fourth. I will grade. be thirty-seven. I, I shouldn't over over age myself. I do myself. remember. I do remember the uh, I, I, being home when the uh, when the 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 Bronco uh, mm -hmm. chase was on. Mm -hmm. um, it was the NBA Finals that night. Yeah. Well, yeah. 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 I remember the final. Yeah. It was the only time in history where during the NBA finals, they actually had to do a picture in picture and show the Bronco chase in the corner and start like cutting Let's in and out of the ride. audio between the actual live oh. finals and the chase. Yeah. Damn. So I think wow. nobody remembers the space shuttle Challenger blowing up. Uh, all, all that happened the same day? No, 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 no. Years, <laughs> yeah. like ten years, like eighty six, wasn't it? It was like eighty six, like a decade before it. Yeah. Like, Wait, what? <laughs> no, it, was, no, it was about five years before that. Some, something, anyway. But yeah, no, you guys are too young. That's all I'm saying. You guys, are too yeah, young. you know, I remember. Yeah, I know. You see that? Yeah. That was yeah. for uh, yeah. uh, Generation X. Or I do remember nine eleven. Well, I hope so. Well, I mean, that was later. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't you have been like 19 or something? No, yeah, Lance, the, the I, was, I was like Challenger 14, exploded. okay? <laughs> the Challenger exploded eight years before the Bronco chase. So I mean, 86, yeah, that's what I thought. 86, <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> it was the year I was born. Was the Challenger explosion? Oh wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> yeah. I mean, I was only six, but I, I remember. I remember. Yeah. Damn, I was eight years old in, and I remember watching that in school too. Like I remember being in class because oh. they had it on TV, and it was just something amazing to remember. When it exploded, it was just like, wait, is something wrong? Is that supposed to happen? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was a lot of confusion <laughs> going on around the time. A lot of confusion. Wait, okay. What about what about Waco, Texas? Did anybody remember watching that? In oh school? Jesus, I didn't. Mm. Oh I don't man, think we watched that. Oh no, be it. Was My too, gosh, man. Probably too uh, too scary to show us in terms of like. I was ninety three. I feel like there were mm. a lot of these like really <laughs> tragic mass events that brought like people like whether you're children or like <laughs> whether like you're adults <laughs> together that yeah, don't. Yeah. As far as I can tell, don't really happen the same way anymore. Like I can't really put like you know, unless you know maybe Trump getting elected, but but that's an election. Like just but just random events like that that happened seemingly every couple of years don't right around the night. really seem it to was. happen the same I mean, way. COVID, anymore. COVID kind of you know yeah affected everybody. yeah I get it's but, yeah it's still happening. Not, not really not really oh, televised yeah, the same yeah, way. Though. <laughs> <It's> not, <laughs> you can't really televise it. it's it's about COVID like you televise Waco. <laughs> I've divided my life into two different uh, segments, uh, pre-COVID and post-COVID. Yeah, I feel like as crazy as things were pre-COVID, things got even crazier post-COVID. Post -COVID. Like you could, you could probably do this like pre-9/11, post-9/11, but for me, it's mostly it's like same with October seventh, actually. That's true. Yeah, there's just there's yeah. been too many change. huge world-changing events for millennials, right? Like, yeah. that's not to say it's like the worst history ever, but like just how many economic crashes, how many massive, like uh, geopolitical events yep. um, instigated hands. by our governments. Yeah, so much happened uh, just within the span of like 20 years.